Well, we do have one more thing here. Why not check it out, right? How do we actually leave, by the way? Like, if I'm done here, how do I... How do I go home? <laughs> they didn't teach me anything! I wonder if I skipped something accidentally because I don't remember seeing a tutorial at all, anywhere. Oh, jeez. This last one on the map is marked a little bit differently. The other ones have X's, but this one is a question mark. Uh, that's not the one I marked on my map. Yeah, look at that. There's two. Okay. I don't see anything. Oh! Thresher Maw. Oh my god. Oh. <gasps> Wait, should I be fighting this guy inside the Mako or? No, it's repairing. It's repairing right now. Come on, come on. Oh, jeez. Now it's overheating. Oh my god. Gigantic off-world uh, creatures that are not friendly. My entire thing is on fire right now. Dude, the gun! The gun! The gun ain't working! Come on, come on, come on, come on! This gun overheats a little bit too fast! Come on, come back here! <gasps> what the heck?! Holy crap! Oh no! You're joking me. Hey! I'm on my way back to that Thresher Maw again, but what's this? What's even that symbol? The little pile of rocks over there? Oh my freaking god, we gotta remember to save more often, cause just now... <laughs> they put me back pretty far. I had to go fight all the husks again, so that was pretty wonderful. Uranonite, or oh, uranium deposit. Oh, it's one more way for me to finish that quest about getting more minerals and stuff. Large deposit. And we get some experience out of it. Okay, very cool, very cool. How much actually? Oh, it's worth like two rare earths, I think? Well, whatever. Take two on the Thresher Mall. Let's see here. I don't even know how to... So, okay, I think in addition to this little minigun thingy, I've also got a, a bigger rocket cannon. But I can't shoot both of them at the same time, is what I gotta remember. Maybe I should just stay far, far away from that thing and hope for the best? I don't know, man! I thought I had more health left too, but earlier I kind of just died in one big thrash. Maybe I should just... Stay away. Stay far, far away and use my cannons. How does that sound? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god! Look! That did so much damage already! That was at least one third gone. I can't control which way the Mako goes very well. It seems to wanna- Oh god! Oh my lord! Stay away from me! Oh, it's almost dead already! Look, look, look! Oh god, come on! Forget about healing! I mean, I do want you to heal, but come on, get the thing! Oh, it's repairing right now! I can't shoot!
Get away, get away! Get away! Dude, get away from me! Oh! Are you dead? I think it died? Oh, that was a little bit close though, like, uh. Yeah, we should practice saving a little bit more often. I don't want to backtrack like 20 minutes again. <laughs> what was here then? What were you guarding? That? Ancient debris. I mean, okay. We were supposed to do that fight in the Mako, right? Not on our feet? Because that seems even more impossible if we try to do it from just three people walking around. Ancient debris. Artifact. Oh! Turian insignia recovered. There are no signs of any survivors. The pot is empty except for a small tattered flag marked with the, the mines, the mini's colony insignia. Hmm. Maybe that's like a quest thing too. It is. Okay, so as far as I can tell, a lot of these are basically collecting random stuff. Is it worth it for me to do so? Honestly, uh, well, we'll see how hard it is to do, but I'm not too keen on being a super completionist. Mostly interested in seeing more lore and story stuff, so I think we can probably go back home now. Because that should be the last of what we have marked here. Yeah, oh, return to Normandy. Perfect. Alright. We can go directly to our next mission, which I feel like should be to find Liara. Yeah, in the Artemis Tau cluster. But before that, I'm gonna go back and maybe... Let's try to do everyone's loadouts in the bottom area. Just give them a quick gun or so and do all their points and all that. We'll just spend a little bit of time doing it here and hopefully be ready for everything later on. I'm not sure if that counted as one big mission though. That probably was a really small mission, so I don't think it's worth talking to everybody again. Shepard. Yeah. Rex. Hey Ashley, how was that? Commander. What's your opinion of the last mission? Kinda wish you'd got there sooner, Commander. Yeah. No offense. They only talk about the, the, the big missions. Wish we'd been able to save the rest. Yeah. If I had been more together, I'll make sure it doesn't happen again. Did we do this one? Do you have a few minutes to talk? One-on-one? -on -one? I'm sorry, Commander. Right, right, right. I, I wouldn't mind talking more later, though. Dismissed, Chief. Ma'am. So how'd you feel? Going on a mission with Tali, a quarian. I mean, she seemed okay with it. She wasn't saying anything weird, but I didn't really talk to her on the mission. <laughs> okay, let's just give everybody some random stuff. Okay, I try to give everybody a little bit of upgrades and stuff, but honestly, my guns in general, none of them are like really, really a lot better than anything anyone's using right now. It's usually just like garbage guns, so whatever. <laughs> Not much I can do about that. But unfortunately, for points distribution, it looks like I can't do it here. I've gotta wait until that person is on my team, so okay, I guess. These six points, we should probably do something about it right now. This will always be useful, right? Especially because I don't know another way that we can bring people back into a fight. Even though it hasn't really been a big problem right now. But hey, more health. That's always a good thing. And maybe I should pick a type of weapon to specialize in too. Pistols, shotguns, assault. This one needs pistols. Carnage. I kind of like pistols, but um, yeah, assault? Assault training is the only way I can unlock tactical armor. So maybe I should just go into assault for now. Sounds good to me. Alrighty then. Let's get back to the galaxy map, and this time, after a small mission on a random planet, let's try to go find Liara. Dr. Liara Tassoni, Matriarch Venezia's daughter. I think we just know that she's in the Artemis Tau cluster, but not anywhere specific. It's not marked on the galaxy map, so let me have a look here. It just says Artemis Tau. 
Uncharted. Yeah, that's why we don't know too much about it. We are out of Trebin. I think we've looked around already. All of these other ones. A gecko? Yeah. And the Biotic Company CEO, I think, is in Farinata, but not right now. Liara would be... Oh, we have so many systems now, holy crap. Oh, my goodness, okay. Liara. Liara's dig site. Sparta? Gnosis? Athens or Macedon? Let's try Athens. These names all sound Greek-inspired or something. Salamis. Nausicaa. Circe. Proteus. Pharos. Alright. Salamis. Not much going on here. Thick carbon dioxide atmosphere. Oh! The daytime temperatures turn the planet's surface molten, holy crap. Orbital period, 0.4 Earth years. Nausicaa. Traces of sodium, otherwise a typical hydrogen-helium gas giant. Oh, we can survey this. Gas deposit. While scanning this gas giant, you detected a large concentration of helium-3. Okay, cool. Proteus. Like the Hanar homeworld, Proteus has more than 90% oceanic cover. Oh, wow. It's really hot here, but also really humid. Gas deposit. Large amounts of free oxygen. Okay, so the collection quests might not be that painful if all we gotta do is click on survey. <laughs> Pharos. Hmm. Oh, Turian insignia recovered. Scans of the planet Pharos revealed an abandoned base on its moon. The recon team found nothing of interest, but much of the debris was marked with the Magna Colony insignia. Oh, so even this kind, we don't necessarily have to go onto the planet itself to find it? Okay. Nothing in here then. What about Macedon? I'm kind of thankful it's only surveying around the places, although it seems kind of um, superficial and stuff. But I don't really... I feel like I've had enough exploration on the Mako for a lifetime already. <laughs> Inhospitable for humans, Padavig. No. Oh, suitable for colonization by the Volus. Interesting. Farjaloos. Standard planet. We found some Zen on here. Hey, we can land here. Shargilla? Level 1 pressure hazard. Dense atmosphere of ammonia and oxygen. Oh. Orbital period, 1.0 Earth years. That's great. That's exactly the same as Earth. The days are a little bit longer, but mm. Okay, hold on. What about this one? Horlan? Matriarch's writings recovered. You were scanning the planet Horlan when a strange signal came from orbit. Navigator Presley determined the signal was from an ancient beacon. Your salvage team brought the beacon aboard and found one of the Matriarch's writings in the storage compartment. Okay. So this one, we can land. Which means there's got to be something interesting here, right? Hopefully, anyway. I guess we find out. But it says there's a pressure. Do I have to be worried about that? Let's go Garrus and Caden today. Ah, our squad is like... Yeah, no one's overwhelmingly good at any one thing, but hey, we'll, we'll see how it goes.
Does this place look promising? I don't know, I can't tell. Level 1 hazard. Stronghold. Anomaly. Debris. Uh, which one? Can I cut across here? Because looking at the map here, it kind of seems like there's a divide. Maybe like a high elevation. Mm, anyway, let me do my points first. Oh, I've got four points. For doing what? Already? Oh, well, I can't get it here. Um, unlock armor? How about that? Will I even want the armor though? Shield boost? Advanced adrenaline burst? Could be useful. Ashley has it. Lift. Lift everything within four meters of the target into the air. Oh, that could be pretty good too. We need seven points in throw. Does throw actually do damage? It mentions the Newtons here, but is that like a damage or what? Hmm. Maybe let's stick with this for now. Yeah. Oh, with the other people. Of course. Caden! Caden is a biotic. Sentinel. Yes. Use tech and... Yeah, I mean, I feel like this is a pretty simple one. This is their specialization, and it only costs six points anyway, which is more than what they have. Way more. First aid. Let's see. Garrus and Caden here. Both of them have first aid. Medicine? Mm, the rest of this? Is that cool? <laughs> Electronics? Uh, but I don't need that many people with electronics, though. Because if both of you have it, then we don't really need that. Okay, you know what? Hold on. Let me undo this. Yeah, I just want to see what the auto-level up will do to give me a little bit of guidance on what I should give them to do. You're the biotic, so how about you go all the way up here? And then lift. Yeah. Barrier? I have barrier, too, because we're both kind of biotic-y. I don't think you need decryption or electronics. Because Garrus has both. So maybe Garrus can be the person to do that? Um... Yeah, how about this? Advanced first aid. Medicine? Knocks out people. Stasis. Stasis requires barrier. You know what? Might as well. Pump it all the way up. Just make you really good at it. <laughs> make you really good at throwing stuff. Sure. Ooh. Medicine? Yeah, okay. Let's do that. And then Garrus here. First aid. He's got a, bit, a little bit of first aid. Yeah, I feel like this last one here is probably a pretty good bet. And it seems like... Turians are good at assault rifles and sniper rifles. Okay. How's this? Assassination. Increases damage done by your next rif sniper rifle shot. Dampening. What's this one? Increases explosion radius on your tech proximity mines. Shuts down enemy tech and biotic abilities. That could be useful. Requires decryption 4. Yeah. But we might not have enough people here to do our hacking for us, because we don't have tally today. That's okay, it's usually crap anyway. Assassination? Let's see here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yeah. How about that? Okay. Now we're trying to go to the debris thing. But frankly, uh, do we have to go above a mountain or something to get there? Yeah, this place doesn't seem as nice as the previous planet. And not like the previous one was very, very nice, but it's like constantly windy and whatever here.
Debris! What's this? Oh! You're joking me! Oh, level 1 hazard means we can't be outside for too long. Look, there's a meter. Hmm. So very unfortunately for us, we don't have a electronic thingy here. Garrus does, but I just did his points. So you know what? Whenever we go on a random planet, it might be good to have Tali with us. All the time though? I'm not sure. Stronghold anomaly... Let's go to Stronghold. I'm getting the impression that Liara's probably not here. But let's try to finish looking around anyway. Oh, look at that. That's a freak ton of people. Oh! But you know what, though? I can just kind of... Oh! Yeah, there's snipers and stuff, but I can just go over them with my freaking Mako. How's that? It's working out okay. Hey, how are they allowed to be outside? I can't be outside. They've got special equipment somewhere? Yeah? On my way. Let's see. Oh god. There's more people in here. I... I have a new skill I can put in my slots. And then the rest of you guys... Yeah, I freaking just go in and... Bust them all out, right? Finally, some action. That was fast. Whoa, 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 whoa! Yo! Fire in the hole. Yeah, I've never tried throwing a grenade before. Wanted to try that out. How are we doing here? Ha! Oh, pirates! These are pirates. Space pirates. We all gone? No. Still a few more of you. Right, so Garrus can do that thing. Oh, are they upstairs? Hold on, we gotta go. Asari Slaver. <gasps> are they doing like alien trafficking here? What kind of slaver are we talking about? Come on, guys. Okay. I think it's quiet here. Do we have any evidence of what was going on, or...? Ah. Oh no, you know what? This is gonna be a constant issue, isn't it? Because now we don't have Tali with us, we're not gonna necessarily be able to come back and get all this stuff. But thankfully, I'm pretty sure half the time, more than half the time, it's not like necessary stuff, it's just equipment. But it's still really sad seeing all these things and not being able to get it. You discover evidence that the Asari leading these slavers and the Sana Dantius, an important ambassador on the Citadel, are sisters. You should return to the Presidium and confront Nasana with this. Ah, that was a lady who kept saying she was busy. We'll see if she's busy now. Yeah, that's sad, but okay. Oh well. Maybe I should... Um, we have... We're gonna have five potential party members, right? So maybe we'll make it so that three of them are good at decrypting and hacking and stuff. So that we'll always be with somebody who's good at that. Whatever, it's not too big of a deal. 
Why won't that blow up? Girl just wants to blow up some fuel tanks and you don't even grant me that. Okay. Oh, ammo upgrade. This is pretty good. Is that it? Well, we found some incriminating evidence. Next time we go back to the Citadel, that woman will be getting it. All right. Next bit. Oh boy. Oh god. Oh no. We probably should have gone around the plain terrains. Not like this. <laughs> oh my god. We're fine. We're fine. It's just a little bit dangerous here, but nothing we can't handle. This one is, again, different. I think the one that we were just at was marked as a anomaly, right? So, uh, I mean, stronghold. This one is an anomaly. Which, um, I'm not sure what the specific difference is. Like, why do we know that this one's a stronghold to begin with? We just know it because maybe they're trying to warn me that there's a lot of fighting here. Okay, I do see a deposit on the map, but I'm not sure where it is exactly, and it's kind of very windy and scary weather here, too. <laughs> oh, God. I just want to find Dr. Tassoni. I'm on my way. Is Dr. Tassoni in this thorium deposit? I don't think so, but uh, <laughs> we'll see. No! No. Ah, ah, ah. Yay. Mm, so I think level 1 hazard just means you can't stand outside for a long time. Which we wouldn't want to do anyway because this planet is gigantic. I don't want to walk around on foot. And what's over here? This? That looks like debris again. Heading to position. What is this? A sorry capsule. Oh, maybe like matriarch writings. Yes. Not clear who lived here, but it appears to have been abandoned for some time. The container has some of matriarch Delingnaga's writings. Yeah, this is just random stuff. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure we're done here for now. I mean, there was some stuff, but it's not like we can get it anyway. Well, that was a bust. Keep going. What about... Horlon? No, we looked at all this place already. Nothing's here. Not in Athens? Not in Macedon? Knossos? Not here... Phaistos? Are many? Nope. Arcanus survey. Nitrogen. Zachros. All of these places we have names for, but it's... Like it said earlier, it's uncharted. So there's not really... Oh, another landable place. Hold on. Therum is a distant but rich industrial world claimed by the Human Systems Alliance. Its plentiful heavy metals have fueled a recent manufacturing boom on Earth. Core samples rich with the fossils of simple silicon-based organisms indicate Therum was more habitable in the past than it is at present. Perhaps this explains the many Prothean ruins dotting the surface, most of which have been looted by mining corporations. Prothean ruins! This seems like a pretty good plan. Liara studies Prothean ruins. I'm picking up some strange readings. Really strange, like off the damn charts. It looks like it's coming from an underground complex a few clicks away from the drop zone. That sounds promising. Oh, okay. 
Now we know it's promising for sure. <laughs> the map wouldn't look like this for no reason. Just wondering though, are we allowed to like go in this kind of place or is it just a decoration thing? No. Yeah, this looks really promising. Oh my freaking god! Something tells me I shouldn't be touching that. Let's try not to. But we're definitely not the first people to be in this place. I mean, usually we're not because there's already stuff there by the time we get there to explore. But this place, maybe it's not habitable. But people have been mining its resources. For sure. Refinery. Uh, we have a bit of a split here. Or, not really. I think we should just keep going. Try not to drive myself into the lava. Is anyone still here? From the refinery. I mean, doesn't seem like it at first glance. Is the refinery still operational? Um... Oh! Excuse me? Did it just drop off these guys for me? Get armature. Oh my god. These are like Geth robots? What the heck? Okay, now you know something is wrong for sure. Geth. Geth is a good sign that we're headed in the right direction. Oh, look at the freaking map. Uh oh. I don't think we can take that strong point head on. What should we do then? Should we go around? Can we go around? Or do you mean, should we get out and use a sniper rifle? Would that work? No, it's not a person shooting at us. It's that, like, turret thingy, which doesn't even have a health bar. So what can we do in that case then? What should we do in this case? If we can't take it head on. Ah, there's a alternate route here. If the Mako would want to turn around. How's this? Geth! It's a Geth turret! Joking me. Really? It's not regular people mining here. Wait, I mentioned Human Systems Alliance earlier, so I thought there was going to be people mining. It might have been, but clearly not anymore. Oh, jeez. Should we try to get out and fight people? It's so much easier like this. Where is everybody? Come on, buddy. Lost shields. Lost shields. Be careful then. Oh, Kaden, not right on there. I meant over there. Thanks, guys. Great job. No. Okay, so there's still a few gigantic red things outside. Probably the turrets, right? But what about inside here? Which way should we be looking at right now? Crates. Yes, thank you. Um... No, we keep going in, so let's go outside again. Was that created by Caden or the Geth? Somebody here? 
Acender Easy decryption, can I do it? Alright Now we can open the gate and get the Mako outside Is there a window here? Mm, we can probably go back to the Mako and use the turrets. Why though? We're trying to move forward, not backward. We don't have to do this. Oh god. Get back in, get back in! Hey! Great! Come on, come on, come on! Beautiful! Alright! There's still a few red dots on the map somewhere, but I don't see anybody walking around, so... Who cares, I guess? Now we do the same thing here, we gotta open the gate. Probably that's the people who are waiting for us inside. No? Wait, what? There's nothing here. Okay, on the other side then. So I'm under the impression that this was set up by Earth, but the Geth are taking advantage of it? Unless if I misread that somewhere. There's a guy here. Oh, that's me! Ooh! Lost a lot of shields from that. All targets down. Still doing good otherwise? Good. Can we go outside this way? We can't jump over? No. I think maybe in Mass Effect... Two or three you can, but for now, we gotta live like this. <laughs> it's okay, we'll make do. By the way, we did get a level up, so that probably means we have more points to uh, play around with now. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! Yeah. Great. Six points! Freaking, might as well get to the end of Spectre training. Now I'm a Master Spectre. Already. <laughs> Already. But it's not useful unless if I need to revive somebody. Which I'm sure we will later on, just not right this moment. Mm. Keep going with the Assault training. Increases weapon damage by 5%. That's all weapon damage, right? Not just pistols? Actually, I'm not sure. Whatever. Keep going. Kaden! Maybe I'll save your points a little bit? Do you want to be good at electronics? I don't know, man. It seems kind of like a waste for you. Garrus? Garrus, you are a... Well, I'm already using assault rifles, but you can be... Actually, this is assault training, but this is assault rifles. Is that a... Oh, that's a little bit different. Well, keep going. You're a master now, my fellow Turian. Caden, I will maybe sit on for a little bit, just in case. Can I heal up, by the way? Good as new. Oh, frick! I healed so much. Maybe because Caden's good at healing. I've learned my lesson. <laughs> and these robots are powerful, but we have a gigantic tank thingy here. I think we'll be okay. As long as we don't fall into the lava. 
Yeah, yeah. Come on, come on. Oh my god, what? How are you even knowing that I'm here? And what are you guarding here? More importantly, it must be something really worth guarding. Oh my goodness, there's so many Geth here. Geth are created by the Quarians, and husks are kind of like created by the Geth. They're people, originally. It's like this weird chain of reactions. Obviously, gameplay-wise, narrative-wise, it's not gonna happen to us, but the fact that every single time we face them, there is a possibility for us to get turned into husks is actually pretty scary, isn't it? Good, good. We haven't seen husks so far, have we? Just Geth. So maybe that bodes well for the people around here. Damn, we have a long tunnel. Oh! Be cool. This place is gigantic. Oh my god. Oh, that looks promising. Any secrets around here? Uh, actually, on second glance, doesn't seem so. Now this looks really promising. It's like a stronghold all by itself. Another tunnel? If you say so. We're actually getting a fair bit of experience and stuff just by ramming over the people. It's great. <laughs> Forget your barricades. They're useless against me. Uh-oh. Is this a dead end? Oh no, it's a dead end for the Mako probably. Oh dude, 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 what? What the hell, what the hell, what the hell, what the- Oh my freaking god. I wasn't trying to drive forwards, but it drove me forward. <laughs> you okay, Mako? Frankly, I'm surprised we even made it out of that one alive, but uh, you sit still, okay? We'll, we'll be back in no time. Let's get in here. Yeah, I was just thinking. I don't see people here. Yet yeah, this looks like a covering. Down. Oh! Damn! My God! Whoa! It's one more, dude, dude. No shields! I've got no shields! Does anybody have first aid? Kaden, you do. Oh, but first aid is not a skill here. Patching you up. Can you guys get him? Can we look at him. Oh really? That didn't get him? Here we go. Things got scary for a little bit there. Let's see. This is good. Whoa, 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 who's doing that? Mmm. I fall back a little bit. Just in case. We cool? Oh, rocket guy, rocket guy. Oh, that's his little biotic shield or something. 
Speaking of which, I have one too. I should really be using it. Good, good, good. Perimeter clear. We're slowly getting the hang of things. Good as new. Heads up. Someone behind us. Good. Sniper rifle coming in handy. What about that side? No, it's just lava. It's just lava. <laughs> Earlier, it was like a level 8 hazard by jumping in there. Not a good idea to do so, especially without the Mako. Anybody else? Shepard, you really need to get a little bit more exercise, a little bit of running, and you're tired already. Oh no. <gasps> what the hell? Ew! Oh my god! Is that a Geth? It was so lizardy. Oh no. Oh no, oh no. Now it gets fun. Oh my god. Whoa! Holy crap, Garrus! Dude, what the hell? That guy moves so damn fast. And my thing is jammed. My thing... Oh my god, they can get rid of my shields in like one thing. We don't even have the Mako anymore, hold on! We gotta get rid of that shield! <gasps> I can do nothing but hide behind. Seriously. And I can't really move too. Hold on, hold on. Guys, hold on. Oh my goodness. Garrus is down yet again. I can't bring him back yet. Oh my god, that jumpy guy is so... How about now, how about now? Garrus! Garrus! Oh! <gasps> Dude, I'm nearly dead too. Garrus, you probably gotta go hide behind the... Oh, that's Kaden, that's Kaden. Okay. Uh, I know we can change them into making, we can make them more defensive or more offensive, but I don't remember how. I know we can move them, and that's what I just did, but uh, yeah, I'll probably have to look into that later on or something. Oh, I just used the... Is it moving? It's not really moving. There we go, there we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Everybody, just unload on this guy. Come on. Yes! Oh, oh! Still one more dude. Who can't decide if he wants to disappear or stay in the same spot or what. 
Oh my dear god. Hey, that wasn't even a armature. That was a, a stalker, apparently. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I didn't even look behind me. Thanks, Garrus. My goodness, though. Okay, so... That's Kaden. That's Garrus. Right, I know that, but, um... I thought in the very beginning they said I can make them offensive and defensive. I'm not sure if I see it in this HUD here. Maybe I can't. I'll just have to remember to, like, you know, tell them to go behind the thing or whatever. Now you know they're definitely hiding something big here. Get ready, everybody. <laughs> Why does Shepard run like she has a stick up her butt? Oh my gosh. Look at this. <laughs> oh, oh! Oh my god, I... My shields are so weak. They get disabled so quickly. Might be because of the... Oh. The guy shooting rockets. But still, holy frick. It's quiet. Too quiet. I've never visited a Prothean ruin before. Aside from the Citadel, I mean. Oh, now that you put it like that, I guess that is a Prothean ruin. Okay, this is suspicious. I don't think we should touch it. Okay, we can't touch it. It's a barrier. Oh, don't rest up, guys. We're in enemy territory. Pull out your guns. Pull out your guns. Assault drone. Oh my god. Whoa! Kaden! Kaden! Oh, everyone! If I use a med kit, everyone gets healed, right? Catching you up. Yes. I'm trying to not overheat here. No, Garrus. Tiles in those holes remind me of a bathroom floor. What? Oh my gosh. Maybe Garrus' defenses aren't doing too great, huh? He keeps getting downed. But I think that was probably partially because we weren't in cover at all. Covering is really, really important here. It's not a running gun. Yeah, I have no idea what these little pockets are. What the heck? Uh oh. Are the pockets part of the Prothean ruin? Or was it built by the people who came here? Uh, hello? Could somebody help me? Please? Dr. Tessoni! Can you hear me out there? I'm trapped, I need help! Are you okay? What happened to you? Listen, this thing I'm in is a Prothean security device. I cannot move, so I need you to get me out of it, alright? How did you end up in there? I was exploring the ruins when the Geth showed up, so I hid in here. Can you believe that? Geth, beyond the veil! I activated the tower's defenses. I knew the barrier curtains would keep them out. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. You must get me out, please! We haven't announced to anybody that the Geth are going beyond the Veil now, should we? 
that in itself is probably a big issue too because if you announce it too early everyone's gonna be scared and panicking and you don't really want that but if you don't announce it then people don't know that's a possibility and they're putting themselves in danger your mother is working with Saren whose side are you on what I am not on anybody's side I may be Benezia's daughter but I'm nothing like her I have not spoken to her in years please just get me out of here I think there's a very high chance she doesn't even know what her mother is doing. We just need to figure some way past this energy field. It's a Prothean barrier curtain. I knew it would keep me safe from the Geth. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. You must get me out, please. We'll find some way to help you. There is a control in here that should deactivate this thing. You'll have to find some way past the barrier curtain. That's the tricky part. The defenses cannot be shut off from the outside. I don't know how you'll get in here. Be careful. There is a Krogan with the Geth. They have been trying different ways to get past the barrier. Not just Saren, but a Krogan too. Krogan probably means mercenary though, judging- Oh, hello everybody. They've all been very nicely just waiting for us over there. Krogan probably means mercenary, judging from our conversation with Rex. Ah, uh, you guys ready? You guys ready? Thanks for waiting. Very kind of you. Okay. Oh god, I my shields are done already. Maybe this wasn't such a great idea. I do have the barrier, yeah. They keep moving randomly. Do you see that? Their animation of going in and out of cover is not smooth. Sometimes they just teleport back. Oh geez, everyone's pretty hurt. Yes, ma'am. Just lead the way. Haven't been talking to you guys much, but I assume you don't have much to say on a mission while we're busy with fighting. We have a mining laser control. Okay. Yes? He's looking back like, hey, who's hitting me? Was that it? Random stuff around here. Good, good, good. Will my inventory get full? I've been hoarding a lot of stuff. Good. Getting some bigger numbers here. That seems to be it. I don't know the code though, and we don't have that many great hackers here. Oh god, it's this kind. But not timed, right? Du, 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 du. Um... Okay, that's one way to get through. <laughs> if you can't find a path, make your own. Makes sense to me. So this might actually be part of the Prothean Ruins then. Something Kaden was talking about earlier with the bathroom tiles. I'm just not used to seeing such advanced looking ruins, because usually when we think about ruins, we think about stuff that's in disarray. Okay. Oh, now we're behind her. Oh, how did you get in here? I didn't think there was any way past the barrier. We have to get you out of here before more Geth arrive. Yes, you're right. I've seen enough of them to last a lifetime. That button should shut down my containment field. It was so simple, but you couldn't do it. Uh. Hmm. 
Any idea how we get out of this place? There is an elevator back in the center of the tower. At least I, I think it's an elevator. It should take us out of here. Come on! I, I still cannot believe all this. Why would the Geth come after me? Do you think Benezia is involved? Saren's looking for the conduit. You're a Prothean expert. He probably wants you to help him find it. The conduit? But I don't know... Let's get back on the ship. And then we'll talk. What the hell was that? These ruins are not stable. That mining laser must have triggered a seismic event. We have to hurry. The whole place is caving in. <laughs> Escape plan! Joker, get the Normandy airborne and lock in on my signal. On the double, mister! Aye, aye, Commander. Secure and away. ETA, eight minutes. Not much margin for error. Well, they're not gonna not wait for us, right? They have to. I'm the Spectre. I'm the captain of the ship. You can't... You can't leave me here. <laughs> or can you? I don't want to find out. Oh boy. Okay, this arena. The Krogan! Is that red geth like a boss geth? Surrender. Or don't. That would be more fun. In case you didn't notice, this place is falling apart. Exhilarating, isn't it? Thanks for getting rid of those energy fields for us. Had the doctor over. Whatever it is you want, you are not getting it from me. She'll stay with us, thanks. Not an option. Saren wants her, and he always gets what he wants. Kill them. Spare the Asari if you can. If not, doesn't matter. You are not very discreet, are you, mister? Just giving away your... your client's plans like that. Oh, Saren wants her. Good job. No, I definitely know right now, Kaden lift, and then... Just do all this stuff. Oh boy, oh boy, I need a cover. Come on, come on, he's getting, he's getting his... Oh, he's dead! That was it? Oh, he's back! He's back! What the hell? Why is he back already? Oh, that didn't even get anybody. Ah! Oh my god. Spare the Asari if you can. Not, doesn't matter. Ha! Ah! Okay, I gotta get some cover here. Caden's already gone. Oh my freaking goodness. There's some people around here shutting them down my shield is not coming back yeah i can't do the i can't give commands while i'm in cover i've got to be looking at the people directly oh shoot kaden's gone again Is he back? Here we go. Sabotage. He's gone. Oh, but he's back again. That was a problem. Same as last time. That's just his thing. There we go.
Let's go, Shepard! <laughs>